that he needs to assume a fairly senior role here in this side all of a sudden. Now that's close-ish. Afternoon, Dooley. Good Christmas. Slipping down leg, was it? Yeah, just missing leg stump, maybe. Could be shown to be clipping, but good decision, I think, from the uh, umpire. On target for setting a very good score. Little edge and taken by Pete McGlashan. Lovely piece of bowling from Tim Southey. Just a little bit of a way movement. A little slow ball from Southey, it was. Almost just drifted away. And a good catch from Pete McGlashan. He had to come forward. Just look at him roll his fingers across that ball. And I'm just, uh, just looking to run it more so. Maybe looking at that backward point region. Slightly opening the face. And Peter McGlashan, good bit of work, Smithy. And a good catch for him. So Shazad has to go for 14 in Pakistan, 58 for two. So new wheels in motion there. Short and cut away this time. This should be out and will be out. Comfortably taken out in the deep. It is the new man, Dean Brownlee, who takes the catch. And Tim Saudi with a ball that uh, won't go down as one of his best has picked up a wicket. Short and wide. Just uh, it did bounce. Some lovely carry here. Nice pace and uh, for Tim Brownlee. He just didn't get on. He'd better off almost ramping that fine if he could. And his car just got too much bat on it. And uh, Dean Brownlee. Good performance. It was quite high. It was above the shoulder. It was in that danger area. Good comfortable catch. Unis goes for two. It's 62 for three. Going through a very similar transition. Here's Southie to Fees. Oh, it's a ripper and that's gone as well. Just a little fake one. And Tim Southie all of a sudden. Talk about stepping up to the plate. 36 Ks. A little bit of shape away. And straight through to Pete McGlashan who makes no mistake. And now for Tim Southie and he's just got a nice little bit of shape. Just really good stuff. Just a, a little bit of a way movement. And uh, a faint nick through to Pete McGlashan who's made a good, comfortable, safe start. So two and two for Tim Southey. Huffies has got to go for 24. And 62 for four now. With four fifties. Patrick Ball has only been uh, two hat-tricks in T20 international history. Jacob Oram has one. And Brett Lee is the other and Saudi with an opportunity Taylor's gone on its slip oh it's a good one but there was a bit of bat now he's got it out oh I thought there was bat it's a hat trick goodness me well I think Umar Akma was a little surprised I'm a little surprised but now there's three hat tricks uh, Saudi in well, I think uh, if it's not in... Bounce, there was a... Look to me like an inside edge onto the pads. And it's high as well. Yep, not sure, Smithy. There's one or two things to look at there, but he's got to go for naught. And Pakistan lose their fifth also at 62. That's out as well. Big Nick, Abdurazak turns and goes, and Saudi, this is becoming incredible. He's got five for seven. He doesn't play the short ball well. Abdurazak, he looks for it up in his half, and that's just another straightforward edge to Peter McGlashan. Just have a five-wicket bag in a 2020 international, and it goes to Tim Saudi, no doubt about that. Big, healthy edge in Peter McGlashan. Well, another one that was made to look pretty easy for him. But that is just an unbelievable turn of fortunes here for Tim Southey and for New Zealand. Over the moon here. Razak out for one. Six down for 68 now, Pakistan.